Hi everyone. Um, I'm doing my, I don't know when I filmed the last video. I'm doing the um, two month, three month, one month, I don't know what it is, but this is basically the state of my Unihertz. I have a, the Unihertz case on it. I ended up buying it. Um, basically looks like this. It's really snug on the case. And um, what I do, because I work in an office, I always end up putting sticky notes on the back of my case. And I just kind of do that. I think I'm more of a pen and paper type of girl. So um, that's what I do. I don't know where to look. Anyways, I'm just gonna be looking at myself. Okay, so um, I wrote all my talking points on the back of my case. Um, so yeah, let's start. I might start profusely sweating halfway through this video. I'm currently in my new place and, um, basically like, I don't know how to control the thermostat in here and for, I've been in here only for a month and there's like a fly problem in the apartment and I'm scared to open the windows because I don't know where they're coming from. And for sure it's inside the apartment because last night there were none and now there's three and pest control is coming just pest control is coming in an hour so um yeah but it's really warm in my apartment and I'm scared to open the windows anyways I can make oh my god I just see them flying around my apartment I might be attacked by a fly throughout this video and I might scream and run away from the camera. So basically I'm gonna start off by saying that um it's been x amount of months in and I'm obviously still using the phone so um I have my iPhone and that's another story but no I haven't switched back I'm still using the Unihertz and I really love it but obviously everything like life has its pros and cons and I don't have any followers so I'm just gonna be honest and I really don't think Unihertz is watching my videos um, because I'll also review your other phones Unihertz okay so basically I'm gonna go through the posies first the positives um, no distractions this phone is basically like distraction free I don't have any socials on it um, so I only have Pinterest on it and I have, let's see what apps I have on it. So what apps do I have? I have Signal, WhatsApp, Spotify, Craigslist, DoorDash, Uber, Reddit, um, Flowbird, Pay by Phone, and like all the Google apps. So like Task, Calendar, um, And that's it so those are all the apps i have i don't have instagram or like tiktok on this phone i've never gotten tiktok um so yeah just like no distractions i think yeah we'll get into the cons of it after but basically like no distractions i don't really feel the need to like reach out for this phone like regardless like the amount of times that I'm reaching out for my phone are quite often but it's not as often as it would be for my iPhone the only times I really reach out for it is if I like have like a reminder or an alarm or a text or I'm talking to somebody like just the usual times you reach out for your phone but other than that it, it's not like oh I'm bored like let me go on my phone and for sure the times that like also, I know it's not good, but everyone does it when you're driving and then it's like a red light or something. I don't feel the need to reach out for my phone. Don't judge me, it's the truth. Okay, um, another pro I really love, um, the keyboard. Love the keyboard, it's comfortable. Um, do I get tired of using it? Um, yes, like sometimes I do, like at the end of the day, I'm like, I don't wanna text but you shouldn't be wanting to text at the end of the day anyways. Like you should be going to sleep, you know? So 
you do get tired at the end of the day like I don't really want to send like long paragraphs or when I text but um you shouldn't be sending long paragraphs anyways so yes the keyboard is comfortable it's super easy to use but over like an extended period of time like you do get tired but I don't think that's like a bad thing it's not like the iPhone where you like never get tired of texting this you eventually are like but that makes sense like it just it makes sense that's how it should be okay so yeah I love the keyboard um and I love the touchscreen duo perfect um oh my gosh it's a conversation starter like people will like watch me like texting on the phone um the most part it's women women come up to me and they're like what what is that or like what do you have there and it's like yeah it's just like they think it's a blackberry but i have to tell them it's a unihertz and they're like you know what anyways and then i explain so unihertz you're welcome um doing free marketing for you guys okay um it's fulfilling it's this phone is so nostalgic like it's fulfilling my 90s um my 90s baby yesteryears of just being able to type on a qwerty keyboard and then have the modern aspect of the touch screen it's very fulfilling to yeah the nostalgia of my 90s self and the current times with the touch screen so love it um oh and then my favorite is the um The flashlight, I love that um, the flashlight's so easy to access. Um, that's like my favorite. And yeah, overall, it's just like a really great phone. Um, it serves its purpose of a phone. I've dropped this phone so many times. Um, nothing happens because it's drop proof, waterproof. I'll be in the kitchen. I'll splash some water on it by accident if I'm washing the dishes and I know it's fine. Um, dust proof i mean where is there not dust so that's fine too sorry i'm like breathing a little heavy okay 11 percent. we still have time i'm gonna get a coffee okay um Okay, now the not so good things. So the cons, the cons, the cons. The flies, okay. <sighs> Unihertz, the cons. <sighs> the flaws. Okay, so basically I can't send images through text, which is very frustrating. Um, I try to get images from my dad and they don't send or I can't re I can't receive so basically I can't send no I can send images with my data but I cannot receive MMS texts which is kind of messed up I just can't receive them don't t tell me I didn't click on it and I didn't download it because I have a <laughs> I'm literally going like this to download it and it doesn't work so I can't download um images through text my dad is trying my dad works in IT he can't download them okay we can't we can't we've gone through settings we've changed the settings we can't okay sorry I'm a bit aggressive it's just really warm in here um it's maybe like I want to say it's like 25 degrees in here okay um YouTube's messed up. So when I try to watch a YouTube video, it's messed up. Let's pull up a YouTube video and we'll see. Um, it's going to do it. Um, let's see, what should we look at? Okay. It always does it. It always does it. So you can't really watch YouTube videos on this phone. Maybe Unihertz will behave because it's no, it knows it's getting reviewed right now, but I really doubt it.
okay it's behaving normal now but okay Unihertz knows it's getting reviewed I have screenshots I'm gonna put them up that's what the screen looks like when I try to watch videos now it's behaving I don't know why but anyways sometimes the YouTube screen is janky um Pinterest it's not good user um it's not really user friendly it's not like the iPhone I feel like you can't help but compare the iPhone screen to don't ask me why my Pinterest is all monkeys right now um the it's like a square like I <laughs> I mean I do know why but anyways <laughs> <it's all monkeys. laughs> there we go some yoga and room decor and purses okay so it's just like see if i click on this purse on the iphone it would be like long so i could see the entire image but here it's kind of blown up so i have to scroll and yeah so i don't know i go on pinterest on this phone because i got used to it but overall what do i prefer i prefer the iphone um for the socials um yeah Obviously, iMessage, iMessage is so great. All my friends have iPhones, so definitely miss iMessage. And I miss making stickers because you can like make stickers on the iPhone. If you don't know how to make stickers on the iPhone, I highly suggest you do because it's so fun. Um, so yeah, so the camera quality on this phone is really low. It just is. Okay um and there's no cases for this phone there's no cases i tried looking on amazon all they have are like the leather cases like the the ones you like slide in like a pocket case um that's all they have um i really want to bejewel this case i think i mentioned that in another video i really want to bejewel it um, I'm probably gonna get like a little or hot glue a little like nook so I can put like a chain and like some fuzzies and stuff um, to make it really 90s so probably be jewel it put a little chain thing and then fuzzies but I think that would be a really good business endeavor you know hurts hit me up I'm a graphic designer let's do some cases but anyways yeah I don't know um, but yeah that's basically my review um, with like overall for the price and what you get out of this phone um which i think ultimately is fulfilling the blackberry nostalgia and the keyboard is amazing and the touch screen's amazing i i love doing this i <laughs> i love doing this um which is getting stickies and putting them on the back of my phone um and yeah, I just love this phone. Um, I don't see myself getting or switching over to the iPhone anytime soon. I just have to say the pros outweigh the cons dramatically. Um, if anything, I think this probably targets like a certain demographic. I think like, for instance, even the low camera quality, I'm the type of like girl that I, I'm the type of like girl, girl, woman, I'm the type of woman to go out and buy like a digital camera and that's definitely been on my list so regardless of like the low camera quality like um I know some people like kind of like the, would want a good camera on their phone but I'm okay with getting like a digital camera and that's something that I want and I think that that's also because of the kind of like 90s factor to like a digital camera you know that's what everyone had in the 90s so definitely you know hurts i love this phone i definitely want to buy the pocket for sure i want to buy the pocket um it worked perfect with my carrier and i'm out in canada so um can you guys hear a canadian accent because I feel like once I start getting in my head about it, then that's when I start to hear the accent. And so, guys, let me know if I have a Canadian accent. Did I just make it thicker? <laughs> thicker? <laughs>
A bud, A. Anyways, um, so yeah, I just can't not hear my Canadian accent now. But um, that's my Unihertz review. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I tried to make it as fast as I could, but um, I don't know when I'm gonna edit this because of all the black, well, the three black flies in my apartment. Um, they terrify me, I'm not gonna lie. And yeah. Um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna buy the pocket once I have some extra disposable income. Um, but definitely for the price and what you get, Chef's Kiss, phenomenal. I recommend buying it a hundred percent. And even it's even if you need a break from your iPhone, it's a good purchase. Uh, sometimes you just need like a digital detox and this phone is perfect for that sometimes like you just need a break like iphones are so addictive and the unihertz is lovely aesthetically it's lovely functionally and i think oh my god did you hear that oh, these freaking flies i oh my gosh <laughs> sorry i think <laughs> just cry. I think, I think that like, um, I can just hear them. Phones, communication devices are not meant to be so addictive. We are meant to live. We're meant to go enjoy life. We're meant to go talk to people, communicate, see people, um, heal, heal heal our wounds heal our traumas heal our our ourselves we're not meant to be like like this like like this you know at least that's my point of view so <laughs> watch youtube never give me views for this but that's my point of view like go outside put your phone down and with this phone like we're we're gonna be on our phones regardless you know but this one at least makes it a bit easier and um i think i'm like you know hurts for life <laughs> for life for 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 life for <laughs> okay i'm so done the coffee's getting to me and the heat is getting to me but thank you for watching and um maybe i'll do the pocket next but thank you guys for all the views on the last video. I never thought that my review would get 800 something views. Um, I just was kind of like a little out of it when I filmed it because I was sick. But um, yeah, I hope you guys like this. I don't know what I'm doing with hand. I hope you guys like this video. And um, I'm probably going to do another short. Oh my god, these flies are crazy. I'm going to do another short. and um, And yeah. Okay, bye.